In this section, we will deal with the armamentarium used for inferior alveolar nerve block technique. Basically, the armamentarium used in the local anesthesia used in dentistry remains the same except for the uh, gauge of the needle and the length we use. The basic armamentarium used is uh, topical anesthetic disposable needle and syringe and the anesthetic vial. Alternatively, cartridge and the self-aspirating plunger and the needle system can also be used. Here we are using disposable syringe needle system which are pre-sterilized using ethylene oxide gas. We can check for the sterilization by compressing the unopened pack for the air leak. If the unopened pack is getting compressed that means there is loss in the sterilization. The syringes commonly used are the 2 ml or the 5 ml depending on the amount of the local anesthetic solution which we need to administer at that time of the appointment. The syringe has either lure slip or lure lock system. The lure slip system works on the friction between the hub and the syringe design. Whereas the lure lock system has a extension with the thread design over which the needle screws on. Now we move on to the needle. The needle is the part of the local anesthetic delivering system which enters the oral tissues. It has two parts, the hub and the shaft. The shaft has the bevel. The bevel of the needle helps in painless penetration of the intact mucosa. The junction of the hub and the shaft is the weakest part of the needle and the point of fracture also. The needle is described on the basis of the gauge and the length. The gauge is the internal diameter of the needle and the length of the needle is described in the form of inches. At this point I want you to pause the video and answer what is the importance of the gauge of the needle and you are free to discuss with your peer and analyze. The smaller internal diameter denoted by larger gauge number has been shown as a significantly higher deflection of needle path and can result in missing the target area. Whereas larger internal diameter has been reported to be more traumatic and painful. Here a 27 gauge needle is considered to be the good choice for the uh, inferior alveolar nerve block technique. The approximate length of the needle is 1 5 by 8 of the inch that is nearly 38 millimeter. At this point I want you to pause the video again and answer why do we use the long needle for the inferior alveolar nerve block technique. You can discuss with your peer group and answer. The total length that needle has to travel through the tissues from the oral mucosa till the target area for the inferior alveolar nerve block is 28 millimeter. A long needle of the length 38 millimeter is used as in the event of the fracture at the point of the greatest weakness that is the hub. The part of the shaft of the needle is still out that can be easily uh, gripped with the help of the hemostat and pulled out. The key point to note is that 27 gauge long needle is used for inferior alveolar nerve block technique. In the next session, we will discuss about the actual inferior alveolar nerve block technique.